Okay. Everybody just restart their timers now. Um, let me know when you're ready. I'm ready. 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 Okay, then I will count you guys down. Three, two, one, go. Mm -hmm. And they're off. Time to move them into their channels. You Super go here, you go here. <laughs> you need to give me a 10 second warning for the people in the Discord. Oh, so I... I, can put, I so if, if they want to follow along. Oh, okay, okay. Instead of just putting go. <laughs> but whatever. All right, and they're off. And Cernicus is just going to be a little bit behind, but that's okay. Um, uh, well, so Cole, tell us about this challenge. The, you can pull up the picture on the stream so you can show everyone. Excellent idea, Mr. Cole. Let's see. I think it's this one. Here, let's. So, Xenerticus is uh, thousands of years behind for some reason. Yeah. The computer sucks. Um. So, actually, Ring Rush, you bring up a great point. Who's going to get a five minute penalty for trying to split up in CCL? You actually can split up in CCL without collecting that note as Banjo. Um, and you can actually get the note underneath Kazooie with a pack whack. Just saying. Um, yeah, G Go Go's stream is big issues for me. <laughs> this is miserable. This is a miserable viewing experience. Sorry, guys. <laughs> but yeah, let me let me go get the picture from this. I gotta download it. So yeah, ex explain explain to us a little bit what this challenge is all about and what your picture is all about, Cole. So, this is Banjo's Super Note Adventure, where you are allowed to use Super Banjo and Jiggy That's Wiggy cool. Special. It's very cool. And the goal of this is mm. to learn all five solo banjo moves. However, only solo banjo is allowed to collect notes. In most of the levels, not all of them. So tell us, other uh, than, tell us about how other that works. Other than really the notes that you really can't, such as MT and mm -hmm. Idle Hags. There's no split up pads in MT, and uh, there's no split up pads in most of the areas in Isla Hags. So theoretically, you could probably DCW somewhere as solo and banjo. And you need those notes to learn split up in the first Ex place. Exactly. So split up costs 160 notes. There's actually 160 notes available to them before split up. Being yes. Red House Jump, 20 in Plateau, 20 in Pine Grove, and then the 100 in MT is exactly what they need to learn Split Up. Right, let's see if I can get this picture on here. Beautiful. Oh, that's big. So a lot of this race is going to be about where do I split up where I can get to these notes and which notes are actually possible or worth it to get as solo banjo. Because there are a lot of slow notes, but there's also a lot of notes that just really aren't easily available. Because you need 765 for... Yes, yeah, 765 is for Sack Pack. So there's a total of 900 notes in the game, uh, and Sack Pack being 765 notes means that these guys can only skip 135 out of the entire game. What are some notes that you expect these guys to, to be skipping? Probably some GI notes. Yeah, there's a lot of notes in GI that are just slow to get a solo banjo, are pretty difficult to get a solo banjo. Um, However, they are going to be forced to go to GI because they need to learn Snooze Pack. So, true. it's all a matter of how they go and navigate things. Mm -hmm. Because Solo Banjo doesn't easily navigate GI by itself, and you would have to split up in places. So, you should be able to just like. 
pause Zenernicus's stream to get it back and then start yeah. it again, put it back. I know this doesn't. <laughs> there we go. All right, yeah. Let's uh, pause, unpause, or do this fast forward motion. There, and the he's kind of caught up. Yeah. <laughs> All right, time to look at chat. I haven't seen chat the whole time. Uh, can you even skip a full world? That is definitely possible. Um, although, which world would you skip? Because you need to go to CCL to learn Sackback. Got to go to HFP to learn Shackback. Got to go to GI to learn Snooze Pack. Got to go to TDL to learn uh, Taxi Pack. So you're you know, going to go to every single level, basically. Yeah, are you going to skip of... JRL? Probably not worth it. I really, really do hope that these guys see that they're allowed to use Super Banjo. Because that, that's one of the things that makes this challenge really exciting, in my opinion. And that is why I put Super in the title, <laughs> and why Asmi is wrong, and that's what... What is Asmi wrong about? Spot. He, he said Banjo's Notorious Adventure. And I'm uh, like, no, it's Super Notorious Adventure. Is, it is the Super Adventure. Um, Cole, what is the fastest way to move as Solo Banjo if you have Super Banjo on? Crouch everywhere. Crouch everywhere. So that is why, <laughs> um, that is why in the hints I put Hint Z. I wonder how many people are going to pick that up. For whatever reason, you get a massive speed boost uh -huh. when you at the beginning of your crouch. Do this. It's similar to Wing Whack with the uh, Kazooie, where for whatever reason in Super Banjo Kazooie, if you Wing Whack, you like go triple speed. Let's make this just the tiniest bit bigger. The physics are just weird with Super Banjo. Like, they, it's not, obviously not made to work with Super mm -hmm. Banjo. Mm -hmm. Because, like, jumping as Super Banjo and Talon Trot is slower. Like, you lose speed because you're not walking. Because that's what's sped up. <clears throat> Alright, so uh, let's talk some strategy. So these guys are all just climbing up uh, my hem temple the same way that you normally would in most categories gogo's or bex rather is opting to get this globo inside of mumbo's hut oh she's ah uh, yes everybody's just taking uh, the golden goliath of course that makes sense just to open yeah, they up want the to get to their cheats and they're getting the notes in this level to begin with in the first mm -hmm. place lieutenant boo asked a very good question what is super banjo tell us cole so, Super Banjo is a cheat in Banjo-Tooie for the Nintendo 64 mm -hmm. that allows Banjo to go really fast. Yes, it basically just increases the speed on every controllable character. Does it? Does Super Banjo increase your swimming speed? I don't think it does. No. No, it's only your walking speed. And jumping, I guess. Oh, did Bex softlock? Yes, she did. <laughs> Poor Bex! <laughs> Bex softlocks. Bex. So that happens when you uh, you jump over a warp pad or something, and you end up out of range of the warp. It's really weird because your momentum carries as the cutscene starts. Um, yeah, that's really rough for Bex. She's gonna keep all her notes, but she's gonna have to get all the way back to MT and all the way back to turn into Munbo again. Yeah, it. It's not a fun softlock. It does work in Banjo Tooie for the Xbox Live Arcade. However, your game will stop saving, so therefore it doesn't work because you're not technically progressing. Yeah, if Bex has enough notes for grenades, which she might not, because she hasn't gotten the trouble yet, and she hasn't gotten the two notes, so she's down 30 notes. She should only have 70. Or 90, right? And it's one of those things where you just don't even want to re-enter this level again mm -hmm. later. It, a lot of this is just 
go to one place one time mm -hmm. get stuff. Yeah, grenades I think would have been good to get now. So, something that these guys are allowed to do is basically anything that's not collecting notes. They can do that as any character. So they can open all the doors, press all the switches, use mumbo and transformations as much as they want, as long as they are not picking up notes. All of the notes have to be picked up as solo banjo. Now I think, you know, one of the tougher parts of this challenge is maybe going to be um, thinking about where you're going to split up. So, yes. Glitter Gulch Mine is not usually a level that you're doing with split up, but these guys are going to have to find a way to get all of the notes as banjo, which there's only one split up pad in GGM as far as I know. Yes. And it's kind of out of the way. Yeah, and so hopefully they realize that they should probably head right to Witchy World. Yes. After they uh, type in their cheats. There's nothing really for them to do in GGM before they learn Split Up. Right, Gogo's headed back to MT, probably uh, headed straight for the code chamber. Xenerkis, you, you can see, is making his way to the code chamber to open it up. As me, like I said, no, because it's the super notes adventure. It because it's super banjo. It could have been the super notorious adventure if we want to be uh, politically correct. Please, both sides there. See, now that's better, Ring Rush. Bex, SMH, SMH. This is the slow way to go, Bex. Going to the left is uh is a little bit faster than going to right. Why why are you kicking that dude? Bex, he doesn't help you. <clears throat> like, I don't like him. <laughs> wow, go go electing to enter the super banjo cheat first. He doesn't wanna auto forget after typing Jiggy Wee special. That's a good idea. I like bingo. Turn them both on, and they're both on, and watch, Gogo's going to be zooming, although you can't really tell yet. <laughs> as soon as he leaves MT, you're going to be seeing him zoom. Zoom, zoom. And he's off. <laughs> he's so fast. And you saw that there. That was the first, the first <laughs> wave dash, as Gogo slides into the loading zone and gets Talon Trot. I wonder how many deaths are going to be induced by going so fast. <laughs> yeah, that'd be fun. Is Gogo going to GGM? Nah. He just knows he needs the nuts. Yeah, Xnernicus' stream is... I'm having issues with it. I, I'm having issues in general today, which is unfortunate. If you'd like to donate so that I can get a new computer, <laughs> so we can bring you some better quality banjo streams, be much appreciated. Oh no, Goku missed. He forgot he had a game. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Xenernicus' stream is like a full two minutes behind. Whoa, he's already in Plateau? Holy cow. Go, go, collecting these two notes. And you gotta, gotta get the two in the water to be able to afford split up. I Bex remembers the type of Super Banjo. Though Xenernicus didn't type in Super Banjo. Did he not? I don't, he's not zooming. Yeah, that's pretty unfortunate. 
I think maybe he got baited by me telling everybody that uh that Jiggy Wiggy special was allowed. Maybe he is zooming. Maybe. It it's may have just... just looked like that way because of frame drop. Yeah, his stream is just in slow motion. Oh, I know okay, why. Yeah. I know why his stream <laughs> it, is in slow it motion. It looked like he was not zooming when he was going up that slope before. Wait, hold on. I know what happened. He He's actually his stream is actually in slow motion. Uh, <laughs> Oh, nice bonk, Gogo. Ah, he's learned the split up. It's time to zoom around this Super Banjo. Okay, yeah, I accidentally pressed some hotkey or something that made his stream slow motion. Oh, baby, we got the crouch slides. Gogo's not doing the crouch slides. He was. Oh, was he? He, he just like, oh shit, I don't have a pack whack yet. I can't. Yeah. Do so pack whack. Packwhack is going to be a very, very helpful move for these guys because uh, <laughs> there's a lot of notes that you got to climb slopes for. Uh, why don't you tell us about Packwhack jumping? So, interesting thing about Packwhack is that the way that it works allows you to jump out of the Packwhack for whatever reason. And so, if you land on the ground during the, the swing animation, you can jump out of it. Mm -hmm. So if you chain landing on the ground during the animation and jumping up a slope, mm -hmm. you can just do that infinitely. And that's super helpful. Um, if these guys want to get the notes on the green glitter pile, if they want to get the HFP treble, you know that's going to be a very important technique for them. Gogo doesn't seem to be. Oh no, Zerik has got a box. You don't want to extend them all the way. You yeah. just want to do short slides. Little short wave dashes. <laughs> yeah, GDO's already done. GDO finished in 16 minutes. So first place to him. Good job. Oh, another bonk from Gogo. -Go. <laughs> oh. Uh, Znernicus <laughs> is getting the warp. Uh, wonder what he's getting this warp for. Is he getting the Globo, maybe? Oh, he's trying to warp. I see. Honestly, Xenernicus, it would have been faster to just walk to the <laughs> behind the tent. <laughs> the zoom over there. <laughs> yeah. All right, Bex finally learning split up. She's going to be uh, starting her first solo banjo section. Gogo -Go opting to swim for these notes. Xenernicus with the Ooh, extra three IQ pack points. Oh, that pack puts whack. Xenernicus back ahead. It does. But Zernicus is it pressing Z? He's not sliding. I said it. They, I said he hit Z. He shouldn't be jumping at all either. Yeah. Dude, look how fast Gogo -Go got ahead with those Z slides. Right. <laughs> Bex, Bex too isn't doing the slides. I'm hoping that these guys like figure it out while they're playing. Like one of them will do like an extra crouch where they <laughs> weren't expecting it, and they'll be like, "Huh, that was pretty fucking fast." <laughs> It's just so silly. Ooh. <laughs> Gogo skipped 10 notes. So, he obviously skipped the uh, Witchy World Trouble Clef. Which is possible to get as solo banjo with Super Banjo. Isn't that right, Cole? Uh, the Witchy World which Trouble Clef? Yes, it is. But that's that's hard. But And those, <laughs> those 10 notes right there in Area 51 are also possible. Oh, yeah, those are the other ten he skipped. Those are hard, though, as well. Those are easy. You just have to be able to think about how the level's laid out. Yeah. They're it easy, does not says require Cole. Sack Quote, unquote, pack, easy. Though. Oh, does a Witchy World Trouble Clef require Sack Pack? No, it does not. If you have Super Banjo, you do not need it. Right. Sack Pack. All right. Uh, so... so Go ahead. I don't know if we're going to see them get that Area 51 notes, but you can get them by just climbing the lamp post like Ring Rush does in a, right. a task and just jump from the top of the lamp post onto them. Especially with Super Banjo. It's a good thought. So we see uh, Gogo just entered GGM. He learned Build Drill. He's going to be hitting this rock because this is your only access to split up pads in GGM. 
So by missing a bunch of these notes here, they may reach a point towards the end where they skipped so many notes that they need to backtrack to figure mm -hmm. out how to find and get some of them that they skipped. Exactly. <laughs> what about DCW? Are these guys going to be setting up a DCW, you think? I don't think so. Yeah. Because there's so many notes by Talon Torpedo. There's that, you know, those 30 down there. Um, and there's not really like a super great place to DCW to. You'd only use it to skip Klungo 2. Yep, and you're going so fast anyways, it probably doesn't matter. Yeah, Ring Rush. Um, I mean, you could still do the challenge. You won't be able to uh, submit it for points. Um, but I don't know that you were really worried about points in the first place. It's a fun challenge. I think, Cole, we need to start a political campaign to get the BTCS challenges on the meme reports. Then everything would be complete. Uh, so, GoGo -Go went to GGM. Xernicus is... Okay, I thought he was going to HFP right then. I'm like, huh, really now? I mean, it w wouldn't have been awful. Because, well, no, okay, because he's you need going back, back to GGM. Yeah. I don't know why he got those notes now. I don't know. He just felt like getting them. Uh, go go is split up. Going for notes. Yeah, Bex and Zrenicus also both making their way into GGM. Wrong way. Zoom zoom. <laughs> And here, I think we're going to be seeing... Wrong way again! Zoom, zoom! <laughs> we're going to be <laughs> seeing our first uh, instance of the pack whack jumping. Gogo's going to use it to climb this slope here. Or he's going to try to use it and not succeed. Yeah, you're going so fast with Super Banjo, you got to <laughs> slow down a bit. <laughs> exactly. Uh, you, just the moves. Like, you got to get the notes and then learn the moves. So... You also have to, like, progress through the levels. So you're probably going to want to get springy step shoes to get to GI and all that jazz. You're going to want to get the battery to open up the door to Toxic Waste for Snooze Pack. All right, so Nernicus and Bex tied right now, making their way to the split-up pads in GGM. Gogo, on the other hand, is done. He got all 100 notes in GGM. Yeah, you go really fast, and all those notes are out in the open. Yeah. So really, the the next play you want to make here is JRL. I mean, it's really the only level you can you can go to HFP, but you want to save HFP for when you have enough notes to get uh, Shack back. I need build drill to get to these split up pads right here in GGM. Yeah. What's going on, Footy? Man, Solo Kazooie moves so fast with Solo Banjo. It's unfortunate that she's dead, though. <laughs> my wife is dead. <laughs> oh my god, he's going so fast. Oh, oh, <laughs> that was kind of scary. <laughs> Thought for sure he was going to fall like way too far out. What, what do you mean, Ring Rush? Are you sure that wasn't Terry? Clearly in the picture, it looked just like Terry. Alright, so JRL is kind of an odd level for notes. So there's 60 on the surface, which are super easy to get. Split up pads right here. Uh, Gogo's just not going to go for them yet. There's 60 on the surface, really easy to get. Now there's the 40 underwater that are not so easy to get as Solo Banjo, but they are possible. They are. They are all gettable. Tell us how, Cole. I would learn double air. <laughs> you don't have to. <laughs> you for the two notes you do in the, the main area. Oh, by the ones by the UFO, you need double air? Yes. Ooh, I didn't know yeah, that. You can't go fast enough. Ooh, Gogo gets clipped. He's gonna you, you don't to, need uh, it for the treble clef because the treble clef hitbox is so big. Right. Gogo's gonna need to 
gasp for air in Seaweed Sanctum. <laughs> it was funny today because uh, SHM was getting that treble clef right. without Talon Torpedo today, and I'm like, wow, this is the skill that you may people may need today. With Shack Pack? I mean, I don't know like how you're going to get on top of the anemone. But yeah, to get the treble clef, you just, you know... Swim little banjo above the treble clef and aim straight down. Swim right at the treble clef. You can pick it up from the top. Bex is making her way to the treble and GGM. Xnernicus just walking. Well, running, I guess. Banjo's little tootsies move sliding. so fast. Not sliding. I did say hint Z. Pretty disappointed that these guys uh, didn't get the memo. Zernicus heading over to the uh, fuel depot notes. Fuel storage, rather. Well, Gogo's picking up Talon Torpedo. And Talon Torpedo is going to be very important for him oh, to uh, open Clungo I'm talking too. Ring Rush. You need double air to swim fast enough to get to the notes in the enemies without getting knocked, because you get knocked back. Mm -hmm. So that's why you need double air. You don't need it to get down to him. But also, the water in the at area is in two water planes. So if you try to shack pack down there, halfway down you'll lose shack pack. Oh, I didn't know that. That's interesting. All right, Gogo's splitting up in town center. He's just gonna pick up some real quick, easy notes here. Now, the, one of the, the downsides of the wave dashing, you know, the, the crouch sliding, is uh, you're kind of locked into that direction throughout the duration oh, of the slide. Oh, is going to DCW? It's looking like it. Oh, no. <laughs> Decided against it. <laughs> DCW is allowed for this challenge. Gogo didn't look at the menu. I'm, I'm disappointed. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna see if I can give opening GDO stream another shot at the risk of crashing the entire stream. Oh, I was wondering what uh, Cynric is doing. He just wanted the death orb. You got grenades. All right, go go getting underwater notes. All right, he is not opting to get the trouble clef. So with that, that's already what sixty notes that they have skipped. Which they're only allowed to skip one hundred and thirty-five. Yo, when is Ask Me One going to do the challenge series? That's what I want to know. Okay, news just in. We got Emo Arbiter. Emo Arbiter's on the on the on the team. Oh, his stream's working. Now, Emo Arbiter started a little early, I think. No, he's he's basically synced he with everyone on else. Time. Yeah, he's already in HFP though, which I don't like. He's gonna find out he needs to come back just for Shack back. Which is okay. It's uh, okay. I guess maybe Emo's thought is to try to rush the early moves, just in case. I don't know. is going down. Oh, he's going for the notes. These notes are really hard to grab. 
because you can see how it knocks you back really far. Oh, he's dead. Which is why you need the double swimming mm -hmm. in order to get yourself back into it as your invincibility frames are going. Mm -hmm. However, like I said, the treble clef has a huge hitbox at the top, allowing you to get hit and still grab it from the top. <laughs> Blow up the door as Solo Banjo. Cole, tell us that's possible. How does Solo Banjo blow up Jolly's door? Uh, by paying two of the balloons. That is correct. Uh, you pay the two doubloons, and Jolly nukes his own door. All right, Gogo's making his way to Clockworks. I don't know what he is getting these for. They're not very helpful. Maybe he wants to Clockwork Warp into GI. Potentially. Potentially. Actually, I think that might be... <laughs> no. He's... Yeah. You're right. I don't know what I'm thinking. Of course he's going to clockwork warp in a GI. What am I thinking? Emo with the menu, by the way. Gotta give. I'm going to give Emo audio privileges for a little while because of that one. <clears throat> so Emo, as we can see, took Hint Z to heart. He's sliding around. I think he just knows that. He probably is. does. I I really don't you, expect You can tell who the do. memers of the community are. <laughs> you know. Uh huh. Now, Rain Rush, um, it's not that terrible because you know a lot of these people, Emo's DCW in a toxic waste. That's why he was an HFP. It all yeah, makes he's sense. Getting enough notes to get the move. Oh, there. that's not. I was not wondering an awful if anybody plan. was considering that. Yeah, but uh, which I it's one of those things you don't have to do that because you're already mm -hmm. forced to get taxi pack mm -hmm. and you're. It's not that much slower, but now he doesn't have to do things that he doesn't want to do. Right. In GI, like opening the door. Um, but anyways, by the time most of these guys, not emo, but most of these guys get to GI, even they're already gonna have pack whack and taxi pack, which means opening toxic waste the normal way with the battery is not that big a deal. So uh, Emo was definitely considering. He was on the fence. Should I save, quit out, or should I walk over to Plateau? And I think, I guess, he decided that since he's got Super Banjo, it's probably faster to walk. <laughs> uh, maybe he's pausing to check how many notes he has. You need at least 515 to... Uh... Yeah, Ring Rush, you can climb down the floors and get batteries on the other floors if you really wanted to do that. Is this zoom, zoom. is this enough to say that Emo's in the lead, you think? Uh, it's really hard to tell. It is hard to tell. Because he also has to make that trip back. Oh, back to HFP, yeah. Yeah. I mean, but you also think that Emo's basically just tied with Gogo as far as levels go. What? <laughs> he made sure to dodge <laughs> those notes. Yeah. <laughs> so one of the rules for this challenge is if you accidentally pick up a note that you are not supposed to, you've got to uh, reset your console, so, which would have been really bad for Emo. Really bad. So Emo doesn't quite have enough notes for this move. Does he not? 525? Oh. Oh. I don't know then. <laughs> oh! However, he can grab some notes oh! in here just, and then death warp back. That's actually sick. That's actually sick. Wait. Because he's... I, I, does he have enough He notes needs the, the treble. He, he needs the treble. And let me tell you, the treble is yeah. kind of hard to get as solo banjo yeah. it's possible but it's kind of hard <laughs> and he's just yeah because you got to get to the roof as solo banjo to get the treble so yeah, you can't yeah 
He's poor emo. It's a good idea, but it didn't work out. Yeah, he's just gonna recombine here. He's gonna have to take yeah, he's, another trip. He's, in. I think he's just like fuck. Yeah, this is unfortunate. Unless he's got some other plan. Oh, I still don't have enough notes. Is he gonna find more notes in HFP that he didn't get before? All the icy side ones. Oh my God, Emo's three thousand IQ. I get it. I think he mathed this out. <laughs> <laughs> no, he still needs 20, unless he's getting the trouble clef he here. He still has 10 on floor 1 eating crab. Shout out to this DCW music, by the way. Shout out to this uh, crowd sliding through the slow, too. I don't know, Ring Rush. It might be, it might not be. So, Emo's gonna go down. Lower icy side, get these 20 notes. And then he's got to get the HFP trouble. And then there is still 10 on floor one. Yeah. Meanwhile. Is that enough? <clears throat> Gogo's made his. Yeah, it should be enough. Because he's got this and this. 20 more notes brings him to 520, or to 505. And then he just needs 20 more, which I'm hoping okay. is the trouble. Yeah, he's got it. Calculated. Wow. What a legend. <laughs> If anything else, it's style points. You gotta give it to him. That could have been a whole lot worse if he had to come back. Now, turning your attention to Gogo, did Gogo learn Taxi Pack? Yes, he did. Okay, because he just hasn't split for it. Because it would have been a mistake to enter GI without Taxi Pack. Emo's showing off the slope abuse. Uh, and this, this jump over to the treble clef is actually not hard with Super Banjo. It's super difficult. Oh, yeah normally, but with Super Banjo, it's very easy. Uh, right. well, he's not going to go gonna all the me. way. It's possible to Bex go all the way, though. Going to TDL. Yeah, so it's looking like Bex and Xernicus took the more traditional Ooh. approach that Gogo -Go went with. <laughs> now he's got enough notes. Yeah, Emo Arbiter, the what, first one to learn what Seize a Pack. Meme. <laughs> Dude, nice jump up there. Uh huh. So, another thing uh, Super uh, Solo Banjo is better at is climbing ladders. Because Pack Whack jumping is actually faster yeah. than regularly climbing the ladders. Now, does Emo bother with like the floor two notes or the floor three notes? Or do you just skip those in the interest of time? I mean, yeah, it's hard to. I think he's got. Yeah, he's going for him. Yeah. More two notes actually. There's like quite a. There's few a lot. Up. There's twenty-five up there. Uh huh. Um, so as far as CCL notes go, um, there's the 30 that are at the top of Central Cavern, which are pretty difficult to get, but possible. Okay, it looks like he, he remembered the 10 he missed down here. Oh, okay, that's good. Yeah. Uh, yes, you would have to climb up the mountain as Solo B, and if you've never done it before, it's kind of hard to find the spots to be able to do it, because there's some slopes you can climb on and some that you can't. Um, but the, all the other notes in in CCL are pretty manageable. I think the yellow exit notes that are up high, you have to do some pack whack climbing with, but it's it's pretty intuitive. If you know how to pack whack You climb, don't have is. to do it at all. You just exit the normal exits by, by mumbo and then oh, do the intended way to the notes. You could just like climb a vine, right? Yeah. <laughs> mm. You just do what you're intended to to get to them. Okay, what's Gogo -Go up to? Is Gogo -Go trying to get the trouble clef? Or no, he's getting the battery. That's what happened. Yeah. Gogo's going to be learning Snooze Pack here. Bex and Zernik is basically tied on their way yeah, towards they're, Taxi they're Pack. Yeah, they're following the same like route here. Oh, did Bex already learn Taxi Pack? Oh, did Zernik already learn Taxi Pack? They both did. Wow, yeah. look at these guys. Oh, that was a sick flutter from Bex. Is she just out of there? She's out of there. 
Backdoor break-in would have been good, Asmi, yeah. Um, because you can get all of the notes up top. Or... Yes, I think that pro back, I would have done backdoor just mm -hmm. for notes. For the floor two notes, and then you drop down. We drop down with the battery. Right. Oh, that's a good thought, yeah. Um, but this, this route kind of, like, commits to skipping the floor three notes. But there's only ten there, so you can afford to skip those. Emo opting... Oh, he doesn't need the battery. He already did Toxic Waste. Yep. So he's just gonna get these and then die. He's already done Train Station, yep. right? Yep. Alright. Zarn and Bex following the same route still, <laughs> getting notes. Do they have the same number of notes too? Oh no. Zernicus has way more notes than Bex. Zernicus has the 20 around HFP. For oh, sure, more. yeah, he's got those, uh-huh. And Synernicus is done. He's got all 100 in, in TDL. Uh, it's hard to say he's in the exact lead because Emo just has to go right back to uh, HFP to learn the move while right. Gogo still has to run around HFP to get notes. But Emo's done zero TDL stuff. And TDL's fast, though. Yeah. And Emo is committing for these floor three notes, which I don't think is worth. No. It's also kind of annoying to get up here. You gotta go all the way around to the rafters, I think. I mean, there's a pole right here. Oh, yeah, true. Well, yeah. yeah he's got him. And now Emo wants to leave the level, which means he's gotta open the door, too. Unless he's going to find a way to get the Trouble Clef right here. I don't know if this is possible. The way I did it is I dropped from the roof. You're on the opposite side right here. Oh. Where's he going then? Can I hit the flight pad? And I, yeah. This is taking too long for notes here. Yeah, I don't think this is worth... Because you can uh, hit the flight pad, get the warp on the roof, and then drop down from the roof to the treble clef at Solar Band you. Uh huh. Does Nernicus make his way inside GI? But you have 130 notes to skip, and I would totally skip these. Cause... I agree. These guys are gonna hit CCL and realize, oh, we only need like <laughs> 30 notes in this level. Right. <laughs> Gogo's doing the pack whack climb for the treble clef. Well, Zernicus is opting for a backdoor break in, which we said we liked. Nice. Yeah. Backdoor is really good because of that battery and the notes are there. <clears throat> Bex finished with TDL. Probably going to be making her way to GI now. Gogo -Go doesn't go for the full send either. Goes for the uh, the median to the pillar. We go for the safe. <laughs> is it even safe, man? Because that pillar is so small. I honestly find it easier to just go go for it. I guess Emo just got the flight pad to leave. He's like, fuck this, this is too long. Yeah, the After investing so much time into it. To get that treble clef as solo banjo, you have to like slide off the roof and land right on the treble clef as you die. And it's like kind of blind too. So it's not very easy. Ooh, Gogo's at almost enough for Shack Pack. Bex making her way into GI. She's setting up a break in. It's gonna do it ice eggless. Pretty sick. No, Zernicus, get the battery. I'm gonna swap to GDO or uh, to GoGo -Go Audio, since I do expect him to finish this challenge in the lead. 
emo was so good until... Yeah, he just tunnel visioned on some slow notes. Dude, look at the strats. He's snooze packing for health. <laughs> I mean, if you got it, use it. Ooh, and Gogo's got 675. It'll mean it means he needs 90 in CCL. He's gonna get the 10 outside of CCL, and then. Yeah. We should have just banned all the extra notes in Hella <laughs> Hag. <laughs> Made this more fun. <laughs> nah, I, th I think it was fun the way it was. And who knows, maybe we'll do a revamp of this challenge. Make him get all, hundred, all 900 notes. Yeah, I did say that I thought the fastest time would probably be just above 50 minutes. Yeah. I would have I'd be surprised if Gogo got sub 50, but he's kind of on pace. Although looking at this, Gogo can skip Gogo can skip 20 notes, which means Gogo's going to the top of Central Cavern or he's uh, leaving now CCL. Nimbus got that battery. Beck's working on breaking. And nope, didn't work out unfortunately. She's used a, f a bunch of clockworks here. She's probably pretty frustrated. She's trying to do this without ice eggs too. Next, just do backdoor breaking. You get more notes that way, anyways. Yeah, hey, this is where you tunnel vision, doing the strat you do in runs. Mm -hmm. Zernicus making his way to Toxic Waste now. Uh, gonna be hitting Snooze Pack. <laughs> go, go! Making sure he uh, does not accidentally <laughs> collect the note as BK. Don't, don't, don't do it, go, go! Pack Whack! Pack Whack! Oh! He, he, he got it as Solo Banjo. Got it. He got it. <laughs> but yeah, you can, you can Pack Whack those notes and you won't recombine and you'll get the notes safely. He didn't actually need them, but... He... Yeah, I mean, since he's going to the top of Central Cavern. Alright, Gogo's got a uh, taxi pack now. Um, I don't know. He's got a bunch of... All the notes in TDL now, doesn't he? Yeah, he's heading out. Yeah. Bex... Bex made it into GI. She's going to be collecting some notes, getting a battery. <sighs> yeah, here it comes. Gogo's setting up. Doesn't... So, <laughs> the way that Nerdicus did this here is that he could literally just do everything in HFP as Solo Banjo. And then oh, did he go through GI? Go yep. Yeah, that's pretty sick. Which is why he got the notes outside the level when he did. Yes, this is right, Gogo. You gotta go way wide right here. This is not a fun trick to do. Yeah, it's pretty sketchy, and it's it's really not obvious. Like, you know, because the mountain's made up of a bunch of planes. Yeah, some of them work, of some them of them don't. Climb. Like that one he's on now, you can't climb with pack whack jumping. Yep. So what he wants to do is he wants to go back he left. He needs to go to the right to left or... Yeah, I, I tested this. On that one. I tested this before the. Yep. The so category. did I, and you can get it. I think Gogo's gonna give up. That one. Oh, maybe uh, emo comes back yeah. here. I'm... Oh, wait, emo hasn't even done GGM. Oh. Yeah, that's what he should have done instead of doing like an HFP trip one. Did he just forget, or did he not get or all the he... notes? I don't know. Because I didn't see all of... We didn't have a stream up, so... He... Oh, he must have skipped some notes here. Yeah, the 20 inside here. What the heck is Gogo -Go doing? What is this? 
What is this even for? What does what this is accomplish? He doing? <laughs> is he? Oh. Now what? What the fuck is this? <laughs> He's trying. Yeah, you can enter Fireside as Bander just fine. Well, to be fair, Ring Rush, you do that with warp pads. Um, but if you don't have any warps activated, yeah, there's plenty of ways to get the fire side as Banjo. Oh, war for early for Bex. Man, Gogo is letting his pride he, get in the way. He's not having fun right now. He's having fun. Oh, uh, oh, uh, you can't climb that plane. Yeah, the, the best way to do it, I found, is to start at yellow exit, and then you, like, jump wide right and hook yes. back around you, left. And you climb up from there, and you can... You go up around the, like, entrance, mm -hmm. and you go right to it. Yeah. Oh, did you uh, finish? Did Gio finish? Yeah. Wow. I mean, he should have finished if... Gogo would have finished if he wasn't stubborn. Yeah. What's Gogo doing? Gogo's trying to climb to the top of CCL. Which is oh, possible, really? he just doesn't know how to do it. Oh, I purposely tried my best not mm -hmm. to collect any notes in CCL. So I got like all 100 in HFP. I got like most of them in GI. I got all of them in GI except floor three in the treble. Right. My goal was to just get all the notes I could so I didn't have to collect any in CCL because uh -huh. I knew that the treble and the top of the mountain was hard and there's so many notes that are up that Ban Solo Banjo would like have to climb in and get. Right. The, he should have notes outside of uh, CCL to grab, though, right? So did he not, not grab those? Or emo coming into CCL here, so he doesn't have to climb up. <laughs> Beck says in the Discord channel, "I'm fast as fuck, boy. Still fast as fuck." <laughs> Yeah, and so you can get 75 in the level. Which level? Oh wait, no, there is 30 at the top. Yeah. yeah. So you do have to do the climb still. This challenge was super duper fun. I thought there was 25. But it's uh, gonna be really hard if any of these runners don't know how to do uh, pack whack climbing. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Cause there's like the green glitter pile that you need. HFP treble you really want to have that for. It's true. I feel like you could still get 765 notes without pack whack climbing though. I think. Did anyone else did anyone else get the uh, underwater JRL notes? No. No. Oh, I did. Yeah. <laughs> and yet yeah, those are the ones that should have been gotten the treble cliff. The, I wasn't <laughs> sure. I got the treble cliff. Emo switched the solo kazooie. Yeah. Oh, so he reset. What a good sport. Yeah. Like, he was he trying to jump as Banjo and it switched the solo kazooie. Where? On the split up pads. Oh, I, I jumped on top of kazooie to get those notes. <laughs> okay, let me post a link. I'm posting uh, the submission form for your final time in the channel. Okay. So, uh, GDO, did you uh, use the hint Z? <laughs> did you? Uh, maybe. I don't think so. Did you, did you crouch slide? Uh, I crouch sliding as banjo is slower for me because I can't chain them well enough. Oh, so yeah. I'm just like not moving. Right. So I, I didn't crouch slide at all. I crouch slided when I did movement as a solo K, but there's such little of that in this run. Oh, yes. So thank, thanks for letting us use a Super Banjo, by the way. Yeah, I, I thought that made it fun. Oh yeah, so what I was about to say before was, I didn't know if you could get the treble clef in JRL without fast swimming as solo Banjo, so I went and I got Royston before I went to JRL. 
Because I wasn't sure if the little tentacles would knock you out. True. Ring Rush has uh, solved the category. <laughs> he says, uh, as per the rules, you can fly up to uh, fly up to um, the top of Central Cavern as BK. Collect all the notes up there as BK and learn Sack Pack without saving. Although, no, you can't, I don't think, because I think it saves when you split up. I think. No? No. no. Well, anyways, that's go loading zones. not what you're supposed to do. Oh. Emo's going for the treble! He's too I, far I, out. He, he, He's he, way he, too he. far out. <laughs> Thanks, GDO, for subscribing to yourself. He doesn't want to do the clock. Maybe I should have made this one a uh, one and a half hour time limit. Because these guys are going to spend a lot of time just going for the same notes. I, there's plenty of notes that they didn't, they just purposely skipped. Mm -hmm. Like the underwater ones in right. JRL. Yeah, I didn't get the, the ones. GI they ones though, they though. didn't climb up for. Like. Hemo's going for it. Going to He's <laughs> 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 it's, <laughs> I did this, and it's, it's hard. It's really hard because it's blind. And you have to go oh, off, yeah. like, the corner of the roof. I mean, if you go directly off the corner and you, you can just. Sort of it. I it. Oh, Sinardicus yeah, going for HFP treble. I thought about it and I was like, nah. Uh, uh. <laughs> that's why I don't like. I, that's why I don't like going to the small pillar. I go straight to the treble. No, he just barely missed it. Oh, you can make it straight to the big pillar. Yeah. Yeah. I, went, I didn't know that. Oh, I, I went to the small pillar. All right, Tom go, coming go, up for go, go. Who's finishing? And. GG. GG. Alright, GG's. <laughs> how Damn. about that climb? Yeah, how about those uh, central cavern notes at the top? Is it really impossible no. to climb up there? It is possible. No. You just. Possible. There's some planes on the side of the mountain that work and some that don't. And it's actually kind of hard. So if you go I to guess. yellow exit. You want to go like way off to the right and then cut back up left. How do we how do I even go to yellow exit as Silo Go up Joda? the red exit and climb up the vine. Eva got the notes. He got the GI trouble. <laughs> good job. Oh, nice. Gosh. <laughs> Wait, is that good? I mean, he's been trying to do it for the past like 5 minutes, so yeah. <laughs> Oh, no. oh, was he trying to to just fall onto the treble cliff? Yeah, from the top of the roof. Oh, Xernicus is in CCL. How many notes does he have? Oh, uh, don't t <laughs> He's like, I'm not touching that note. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I I did the same thing. I walked in, I got out of Talon Trot, and I like jumped way to the left. I mean, he's looking yeah. at the, the he's, split up pad. He's like, what trying the fuck to figure out there? how to split up without he's touching the note. He's typing in the Discord. Just try it. Just try it. Is he? Yeah. yeah. Hello, it's I was like, hard. I was like, must make it <laughs> to the edge. Go go. What notes did you skip early on? I mean, the 30 in, G in which you roll. I, I pretty much skipped all the impossible notes. It's really that I did. It's really the fact that I didn't yet pass floor one in GI that caused that. I, I went to floor two in GI, and uh, I also got the treble clef in JRL, as well as the notes by Talon Torpedo. Wait, you can get the treble clef as Zelo Banjo? Yeah, you just swim down from the very top. Oh well. I when I was going when I was doing the swim to Talon Torpedo, I tested it on the egg nest that was uh I tested it on the egg nest to see if you could like get it without being deflected away. And oh, well. I, uh, I made it, so And so I was like, okay, I guess I'll do this as banjo. So after getting Talon Torpedo I went to Ancient Swimming Baths, split up, got the treble clef, and then got the two notes by Talon Torpedo. <laughs> I got like maybe forty notes in CCL. Because I wanted to skip all of them. 
I mean, I got pretty much all the notes in the game that were possible, except for anything well, plus well, past Evo split that one. Up also, as yeah, me, <laughs> he, he messed up getting the notes on the split up pad. Uh, you said you skipped thirty notes in Witchy World. Yeah. The treble and the fence. Oh, the right, yeah, duh. So you can easily get those fence ones. You you know how? <laughs> Oh, by climbing on the, like, the lights? Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> I thought about that, but I thought there's no way it's faster than just getting 10 extra notes somewhere else. Yeah. I mean, you only need to climb up, like, two pack whack jumps high, and then you yeah. jump over. Or, really... or, or if you want to be swaggy, you could do it from Cactus of Strength, where you go out of bounds. Yeah, that's <laughs> Ring Rush was praying for somebody to go out of bounds. Oh, Bex! Or oh, that was Emo. Oh, Emo! Getting the <laughs> the solo Kazooie notes with the pack whack. Which you can do, by the way, Gogo. I saw that you went for the risky strat of, like, trying to get the note before recombining. Yeah. And it did work. Like, I, I really yeah, didn't want it. Just like, barely but... worked. <laughs> Alright, Zernicus, stand on the edge of the pad. He, he realized how dumb he was after talking about it. Oh. There you go. There you go. Good job, Zernicus. There we go. Uh, just don't get the note. <laughs> just don't get the note, oh. man. <laughs> you don't need that note. Not done for emo. Oh, not done for emo. Good job. GG's. Let's pull him in. Jeez. Oh, there's no end to pull him in. <laughs> there is no <laughs> pull in. <laughs> I don't know if anyone else did it, but I had like a 200 IQ idea for a route. So after I got snooze pack and the notes inside, uh, and the notes inside toxic waste, I went to HFP through the pipe and got all the notes on icy side. Then I death warped and finished up GI, so I didn't have to go to icy side the second time. All right, GGs. <laughs> Ging -ging. Good job. I loved your route, emo. GI. And then. He just got punished. I didn't. I don't fucking know the slope climb in CCL, so it's I went hard. in five notes short. Oh, rough. Yeah. So that because I was gonna skip the GI treble, because my whole plan was skip the thirty in Witchy World that you just can't get. Well, you can get. You can't get, you get all the thirty of them. You can get all of them. Yeah. But the the, the fence notes the are like notes. reasonable. The. Van so the notes I aren't. cup note, you can just climb up the pole for one of the lights and then just jump to the fence. Oh my god, those are climbable. Seriously? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. You know, well, skipping those 30, uh, I thought you could. The trouble clef, you can uh, jump. You can jump from the, the rope for the gondola. So you grab the ledge right above the outside of space zone, pull yourself up, jump out of bounds, pack whack, land on the trouble clef from out of bounds. <laughs> Ring Rush is also making a point in chat that if you uh, fall off, like you slide off a ledge and snooze pack, you don't take damage. So it would have made oh, the I chat trouble easier. I, th I, th I think in tax, if you did that with tax effect, it also works. Yeah. I, I didn't know if that went forever or if it like reset your oh, Bex! wall timer. <laughs> Bex just yeeted herself off the level. <laughs> oh, see ya. <laughs> and then you can also get all of the notes in JRL. You can I get, did not want to go swimming. You can get all 900 notes in the game as solo banjo. I figured. So I was going to skip like the TDL trouble. So I wasn't too sure about that jump. I didn't feel like mm -hmm. messing with it. And I thought I didn't need the GI trouble. Oh, and then just it all fell apart. Yeah. Nernicus. I think swimming, swimming for the notes in JRL was really worth it. I, yeah. On the route. So Nernicus is sitting on 750. But... I, I probably would have, like, if I did the, bi the uh, not bingo, if I did the route again, I probably wouldn't have uh, got fast swimming for that. Ooh, Bex forgot 20 notes in GGM. Dude, I, the GGM, I went to GGM four times. Yeah, we saw that. Oh? oh. Yeah, I was like, why are you back in GGM? I'm like, oh, you missed notes there. I, I never, I, yeah, I, because I went as the detonator, I was like, well, I don't have split up yet. So I had to go back, and I was like, well, I have DCW set up, so I can't go into Fuel Depot. What did you do as the detonator? I DCW'd. He DCW'd oh. into Toxic Waste. 
Okay. Uh, well, Ring Rush, when I say you can collect all 900 as solo banjo, I mean more that all 900 are collectible as solo banjo in a vacuum. So, like the MT ones, you can DCW to MT. All the other interesting Isla Hack zip ones, that Zernik has just got. you can uh, DCW to the respective area of Isla Hags. <laughs> <laughs> Zernik is... Oh, he made it. Wow. Yeah, uh, to the... I didn't know uh, you could make that. To the Jinjo house. And... Time! Solid finish. 104 <laughs> from Zernikus. It's pretty good. Let's pull him in. GG's, Zernikus. Alright! GG's! GG. Oh, GG. man. That was uh, really funny. <laughs> you fi figured <laughs> out how to use the split-up pads. <laughs> <laughs> did you uh yeah. did you get any penalties, Ernicus? Right, no, no he I mean I reset, so right, they don't didn't He's count. He's good. Yeah. Nice job. Oh, oh, so I, I saw you look at the pads and then you stopped from like, like <laughs> Let's go to Discord. Let's see what this guy's and then, saying. And then I was like I saw you typing in Discord. <laughs> I was like, please tell me I don't need to DCW the Mingi as solo B. Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> glad that wasn't the uh the trap at the end. Right. What's up? All right, but sort this of was, was a because really funny goal. If you weren't careful, you'd have to reset. Mm -hmm. I also yep. assumed uh, I don't think there was a way to get the one on Kazooie's nest or Kazooie's split up pad. Pack whack. Uh, you could get it with pack whack. Okay, or I just figured if you have massive, it. you know, uh, French Canadian balls, then you just run into the note and pick up the note before you recombine. Which is what goes. Yeah, I did. tried, but it, it didn't <laughs> work out. <laughs> I tried to jump into it, and then I was still on the pad, so I switched to Kazooie, yep. and I was like, fuck me. I watched that, and I'm like, oh my god. He that was tried brutal. Yeah. Oh, you, you switched to Kazooie, and she automatically collects it. She automatically it. grabs it. Yeah. Yeah. Rip. <laughs> yeah, there were a few things that I was sad about, like dying in HFP. I really wanted to do, like, all of HFP from GI yeah. as solo banjo and learn check pack, but oh well. Yeah. Let's see if Sunday's I only did. I only did Icy Side. I think Sunday's done. Notes, he said GG. Oh, after getting he... all the notes on Icy Side, I realized that, you know what, going all the way back to Fireside is just going to be slow, so I death warped out of HFP back to GI. Oh, he's working. I ended up Fireside. doing that too, but I death warped by accident before grabbing the last 10 notes at the bottom of Icy Side and ended oh. up going back, which sucked. Yeah. I, I pretty much grabbed all the easy accessible notes uh, on. Until GI, where I basically didn't get past floor one, and that's what caused that's what caused me so much time. This I did backdoor break in, so I had access to yes, all the Yes, backdoor break in was the play to do there. I was trying to it think of a way to get than just learning springy step shoes or clock clamber boots. Well, though. well, the, you break in from the back, you split up, get all of those notes, grab the battery, drop down, put it in. I should have got the battery before going down to floor yeah, one. Yeah, that first was the time, one thing you did. But then I realized, I realized yeah. only after like going down to the floor one notes, it's like, oh, I should have had the battery with me. Oh well. But yeah, that back door was the play there. <laughs> and I wanted to get the GI treble so bad, but I was like, how how do I get banjo outside like mm -hmm. in a reasonably fast way out to the front? So. Ask you. Oh no, thunder. Uh, um, oh okay. so. Uh, so just to say, I was this close to actually do a hybrid banjo for that challenge, except I didn't want to, like, all right, is that still solo banjo? Is right. that BK? Is that what? Right. And I'm going to tell you guys right now, none of our challenges, I know Cole's coming up with some of them, none of our challenges are going to make you do hybrid banjo or anything like that. So... Don't worry about it. Also, I realized really late into this that just Z sliding everywhere with solo banjo is probably that's, faster. So remember yes. when I put hint Z? <laughs> oh, that's what that that's meant. That's what that meant. Yeah, yeah I spent like you the can... whole thing not using it, basically. Get a hold Z. I I spent the whole time not doing it as well, but I'm just really bad at it. And I end up going slower than just running. I did really enjoy the slope abuse with Packwag sections, though. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm, I'm afraid that not everybody knows about that, because Sunder's sitting on 670 notes right now, and I think he's trying to figure out where to get his last few. Wonder oh, how the first thing I said when I came in here. Yeah. <laughs> this challenge really sucks if you don't know how to Packwag. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
Because oh, the notes you miss out are the, the glitter pile, the green glitter pile, HFP treble. Okay. What else do you like absolutely need slope abuse for? Well, I used it to get HFP a... treble. You can go in through volcano. You can That's use the oh pad. yeah true yeah super banjo will make that jump. That's also true. I I did get that treble. That was like the last thing I got before going to CCL because I was like, I was not confident I could do CCL without those twenty notes. And I think I was right, because I don't think I'm getting Banjo up to the 25 at the top anyway. And I was only five notes over if I had went to the Skull exit. I think I got everything else besides the 25 at the top and the five on Kazooie's mm -hmm. pad. Oh, right. Bex has 660 yeah. notes. She's making her way over to, uh, making her way over to Sack Pack to CCL. Oh, wait. No, there is another 10 notes somewhere. There's 30 up top. Yeah, thirty. Up there, oh, it's yeah. not just uh. Yeah, there's okay. it's on the uh, there's one on the other side of the path. Right. There's one in oh, front but then there's still one in central cavern. There's still one more note nest in in front of a living zone that I didn't get. I guess the, 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 the super duper part. high one. Yeah. yeah. No, I did get the yellow one. Just now. Which one did I not get? I got both water exits. Did you get the pot of gold exit? Not pot yeah. of gold. Um. Yeah. yeah I did. Whatever the high teal exit goes to. Yeah, I got that one, I think. Because I went over the blue skull and slope abuse around it. To it. Yeah, I definitely got that one. Oh, I didn't get the first one! Oh, uh, <laughs> Level entrance, because I had to avoid it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> of course. That's funny. And I didn't think to hit that warp pad at the start. We all need back. to watch Bex right now, make sure that she doesn't make that mistake that Xernicus was so afraid of making. She's walking in. <laughs> yeah, it, it definitely throws you for a loop. Thunder's going for floor four early. She didn't get it. Good job. Yeah, I can see the final note up there. <laughs> yeah, I think Thunder's <laughs> realizing that he needs to get either the floor three notes or maybe the treble clef. Yep. Oh my god, Bex with the I missed, jumps. I missed one node nest around the big top, and I was like, eh, I'm probably going to be punished if I don't go back for this. <laughs> There oh. we go. I I posted some hints <laughs> Another in the for our runners. Another Bex. runner approaches the split up pads. You can do it, Bex. Just a little bit closer. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> nice. Nice. I feel like TDL oh. was the only really smooth level. Oh. I don't, she got it. I, I count it. She yeah, got it. Yeah, Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't obvious whether or not she got it, but she got it. I don't care. Okay, yeah, and I could just pack like the one. Guys, Kazooie, does she like, know I'm sure if every stuff? single person Absolutely just not. ran into Kazooie there, they would just like get. <laughs> they would rejoin and get the note at the same time, and it's like, ah. Uh, mm -hmm. For me, there was, was a cool. clear gap. <laughs> yeah, it's pack whack. Just use pack whack. Hitbox extensions. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't think of it here, because I thought of it for like TDL treble, but yeah. Does... Where do you make that jump? Does he just jump high enough? Am I dumb? What yeah, you, you can just about? jump up. You can pack whack jump up to TDL treble. I wasn't hard. sure. I wasn't yeah. sure if he was high, he got high enough, yeah, so I skipped I, it. I just pack whack jumped up to TDL treble I'll, and got I'll, with uh, taxi pack. Yeah. Also, Sunder's been stuck at floor four early for a really long time. Yeah. yeah. I decided not to do upper GI. Like I just skipped four, floor three notes because there's only mm -hmm. ten up there, right? All right. It's right. one of those things where. He shouldn't even be doing floor four early because he's got enough notes for the claw climbers. Exactly. Yeah. Or that. Yeah. I thought about you the climb thing, and as you go, you get notes upwards. Like so. mm -hmm. yeah. Oh yeah, I got the floor three notes and I didn't need to because I thought that I only had t fifteen notes left in CCL that I could get. Right. <laughs> oh, he's got it. Nice yes. job. When I was getting clockworks, I almost thought like, am I even going to use clockworks? Like you can't use it to grab nodes, right? And like you're not going to be able to use this solo banjo. But then it ended up helping a lot for backdoor breaking. So. Yeah, that's really the only place I, they were used. I almost skipped them too, but that's the same reason I got ice eggs. I was like, oh, do I need these? I'll break it. <laughs> if I did front door breaking, that would have given me a lot. Would that give better access to the treble? No, not really. 
You nah. still need to like fall down from the roof somehow. Nah. It's really rough. Oh, Cole, shut up! Don't or just listen open the front door. To Cole. Oh wait, <laughs> can I just? Can you just get it from the front door? <laughs> you open the front door. <laughs> go outside. You can probably get it. In which case, yes. that battery. You can't. You really? Is this too high? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you have to fall. Well, I'm glad I didn't try that then, because that was what I was going to try if I was going to go for it. How many times did I die on it? Five? <laughs> yeah, you, you gave it some attempts. I didn't know that Shack Pack and Taxi Pack just let you fall infinitely. Mm -hmm. Wait, they do? Like, if yeah. you walk off a ledge with it, you don't take fall damage? You have to, like, yeah. slide off with it. Oh, that would have been really good to know. Yeah, I, I, I died didn't... from fall damage so much as Banjo. Well, no, with Shack Pack, I'm bag. pretty sure you still take fall damage. <laughs> Look how hard. fast you move with Super Banjo and Shack Pack. <laughs> I know. That's funny. Mm -hmm. yeah, I think Bex is going to have to leave the level for more notes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she needs 95 in the level, and I'm assuming she won't get the 30 up top. So, Sunder's missing 30 notes in GI, which are... Okay, it's the floor 3 notes That's in what the I treble. Did. Yeah, I got 70 out of that. Uh, didn't he already get the floor 3 notes? He's getting them right now. Oh. oh there I they are. already got them. So, I guess something that I didn't make obvious enough is that if people really cannot figure out how to get some of these notes as solo banjo they should just take the penalty, the five-minute penalty for every note nest. And maybe I, I should have made that more obvious. So you can, you can uh, post that in the chat now. Yeah, I will. Five minutes is a pretty steep penalty. Yeah, it is, but, note but note it's better than not learning sack pack. True, but yeah, I feel like it should have been like one minute per note nest so that people are not like so discouraged. Well, I didn't want to make it Unless one minute per note nest because I didn't want people to strategically take the penalty because it's faster. Because yeah, you could probably. Do you think there are some the... notes that are yeah. less than a minute or more Maybe. than a minute? It definitely does not take four minutes to do the HFP Trebo Clev. Took a while, but it is twenty notes. Also, I assume if you get a treble clef, it's a forty minute. No, sorry, twenty minute penalty. Did anyone else accidentally snooze pack like five times? <laughs> Not at all. But I wasn't Z sliding uh, around. I, so. I, uh, I, I taxi packed a lot of time. <laughs> Mine was always turning right for some reason, so I got the stupid snooze pack animation. <laughs> I just ran everywhere. Yeah, I just ran too. All right. Wait, isn't this a grip grab ledge? Oh, but you no. can't jump up from it. So. Where? By GI. Outside. Nah, there's still no way you can jump even close high enough to get that trouble. Yeah. No, I tried it earlier. I think Bex went to every level so far, right? So it's gonna yeah. be a little slow to find 60 notes. I mean, 35. Yeah, I didn't want to skip anything that I knew I could get in the, like pretty much in every level <laughs> until GI. There was um Is there any way to get the last 30 in JRL? Yes. Oh. You can get every single note. Okay, I tried swimming into one of the Yeah, like, for the those guys. ones that you tried to swim into, you need fast swimming. Oh, okay. Oh. And what about the treble? You can just swim into it from above. Oh, it's tall enough. I was thinking yeah. about trying it, but I didn't want to, like... I thought that, having already tested on the other one, I was like, I guess it doesn't work, so I didn't yeah. go for it. Yeah, for oh. those other two, you need fast swimming, so... I, it's speaking, a meme, but you can Oh, baby, Sunder. <laughs> it, if the penalty puts you over two hours, it's fine. It's, it's just a two-hour time limit for, like, <laughs> actually playing the game. Well, we didn't actually close. specify two hours yeah. for this one. Also, oh, I, I'm, no. I guess not. Also, I'm pretty sure that um, getting the Belair was faster for this challenge. Just for the 10 notes? 
and getting down there and solo banjo. I I got double air just <laughs> just yeah. to get the notes in uh, Atlantis. Well, it paid off. Uh, what was your final I time, also... GDO? Huh? What was your final time, GDO? Fifty twenty-five. Pretty good. Damn. Pretty good. Nobody got sub fifty. I didn't think anyone would get sub fifty, but GDO, you came really close. There were like zero problems with the route that I took. The only thing was when I was going up to Upper Fireside after getting the two ladder notes, I uh, I couldn't make it up the ledge as Banjo. So after I fell off and died, I was like, you know what? Let's just go up as Banjo and Kazooie. <laughs> ah, there we go. Okay, yeah. So trouble would have not been too hard, Jiro. But yeah, actually, I did make it up that fireside ladder slope with pack whack abuse. The, the I mean, scene. you could have just sl slid down from the top. Hey, oh, he got oh, it. He got oh, it. Nice. Good job, Thunderstorm. Thunder got it. All right, so Bex needs twenty more notes. Which is she oh. going for the the GI trouble now? <laughs> Claire yeeted herself down to get the treble clef also. <laughs> it's only a 65 in which you roll. She must be missing like burgers or something. Oh yeah. You guys play as Solo Kazooie at all? Was there ever a point? Oh. No. There's no reason uh, to. Just, yeah, just, dead. just my one accident. My wife is dead. dead. Top, you mean Terry's dead. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> you mean Terry Billy's dead. <laughs> I think that was the only thing I used Solo Kazooie for was opening the path to Cliff Top. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. I like my picture. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Such a stupid picture. Uh, Solo I, I, I laughed when I too. saw jam jars. I was like, it's <laughs> a, a hilarious. That's like profile picture worthy jam jars picture. Ooh, Snopey uh, points out that Thunderstorm got to the roof as solo k tag the yeah. up there i yeah see that's a an example where i thought uh -huh. it might help to use solo k i was almost thinking like i had just about 545 in that floor two room i was like should i just leg spring up and tag warps but, oh yeah i mean you know, claire me. you had a uh, claw climber boots you could have just climbed up gi normally yeah i think right. people are like so set in the gotta do speed run stuff that they just forget about the intended stuff sometimes. Oh, Sunder, don't get it! <laughs> I love the pauses right? of like, oh shit, no. Okay, so Bax just ran right by the claw clamber move. She still doesn't want to learn it. But I guess she's been up to the roof. She's already so done floor four. Already. Yeah, doesn't really need it. All right, what does Sunder do with the, the split up fads? You at least gotta okay. try it. Okay. Everyone, everyone just looks at it real close and then slowly. <laughs> there you go. Literally paused and I like, but looked at everyone. it thought for a second. I don't think Sunder's even been in CCL. This is his first time, so he it only is. has to get like 50 notes in yes, here. He's, he's like done. Yeah. This is, this is like he, do, he doesn't want the kill Zui notes. <laughs> Bex is I, frantically I trying to figure out what to do. One. Yeah, I think Kimo like his... did the smartest thing and just pack whacked them. That's it is yes the best thing yeah. to do. Seems obvious. In Everyone hindsight. else either jumped into them or ran into them. Mm -hmm. Yep. <coughs> I like this challenge because it really rewards creative thinking and also because I I, I don't usually see banjo race. Yeah. Movement. I mean, sorry, not banjo. Uh, super banjo is what I meant to say. Uh -huh. Yeah, I, that's why I thought it would be really fun with it. Uh huh. Yeah. I like this challenge. Otherwise, until I it, would, math. it would probably have been another like twenty to thirty minutes of people finishing because solo banjo is so slow. Right. Yeah. Yeah. No, this would have sucked without super banjo. I played all the way up until the golden Goliath reset when I was like, wait a sec. It says Super Banjo's allowed, and then I was like, oh, thank god. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, we were wondering if anybody was gonna miss it. Like, they didn't quite read through everything. I was so happy and, to read it. I was like, oh my god, that just as me like was not uh, As me was not racing, so every, of course everybody got it. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Poor guy. Did Bex hit the flight pad? She did, and she's 
trying to die now. I think is is her plan to get this trouble, Clef? The GI trouble? I think so. I hope so. I think so. Probably. Yeah. All right, five more notes for Sander. I hit the flight pad in my first trip in GI. I was like, nah, this is so slow for 20 notes. And then yeah. Abandoned it. But we were like, uh, you invested so much time. You were literally like within a 30 oh. seconds of getting it. So I yeah. gave up. So, Sunder, your last 15 notes are on the way to sag bag. Well, because I did the math wrong in my head. So I was like, I think I'll be okay without the trouble. And then fucking. 690 does not mean I need 65 notes to get sack back. Mm -hmm. Were you thinking maybe like add the 10 from uh, Wasteland? Yeah, I forgot I had those 10. I, I, those I think I big. I think I did. What is Bex's plan here? Is there a split up in the? Or I like five? I double included them for some reason. I don't know. I thought I needed 65. There's no split up pads on floor five. You're intended oh. to split up on floor four to shock spring pad up through the thing you undid the screws for uh, to get the GDF. Uh, Sunder's good. Sunder is good because he he's going to get the entrance notes. And then there's ten by Sackman. Yeah. Baby. Are we done? Nice. And. 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 Mm -hmm. Oh. And... GG! GG. GG. Sunder with a 129.29. Yeah. GG. I think I bonked on like four out of the five of the Damn, moves that really? were required. I bonked four. Max never got the notes <laughs> in the toxic ways. <laughs> yeah, those help. Mm -hmm. There, I think she's good now. Yeah. Not yeah, I probably saved those last ten. Mm -hmm. All right, then I think we're all finishing up. Nice. Oh, did Be Bex get her last few notes? Yeah. Did she get the yeah, trouble think... first try? I I don't think she got. She the didn't. Trouble. She didn't get, get the trouble. Oh, so she still needs ten yeah. more. Or oh, the ten by the sack. Ten more, she hasn't gotten those yet. Yeah, she did. She did. She did. Oh, she, she did. did. Dang. All right, yeah. GGS. GG. All right. What? Oh yeah, Dingo's still going too. If you want to put him on stream. Yeah, I was gonna ask uh, you about Dingo. I, oh yeah. yeah. Dingo was racing too. He just said "fuck it" and grabbed the treble as BK. <laughs> GI. Uh oh. Mm -hmm. I, 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 that's fine. It's five yeah. minutes. No, the treble. Isn't that more than five minutes? I said every note nest was five minutes. Oh, you did? Okay. Look, I really didn't want people strategically I mean, I get it. taking the penalty. Right, but I wanted it to be like a, a like a last resort. Where is Begs going right now? She's got a bunch. She's, she's forgot a note nest in she here. She missed the nest around the tent or something. She only had 65. I also missed one here. When I checked, I had 65. I was like, why don't I have seven? It's really awkward routing well, yeah, right pretty much there. every world with uh, just solo banjo. GGM was especially bad because the solo. The, the only split up pad I could think of was in the just outside it the power the hut. One. It's the only one. Yeah, it's so out of the way. And then I died by accident before getting all the notes, so I had to go all the way out of the cave. So. Oh no. I was thinking that I could come back with a tax or yeah, with taxi pack to get the treble on Witchy World, but I was wrong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just watch this is a good thought. Yeah, did you see what Cole posted? Yeah. Wait, let me see this. Oh, I didn't. My witchy world route was pretty straightforward. I just like I I went oh, what straight to split up, and then I went and split up in West Zone, got the ten notes behind the doors, went learn pack back, and then I just ran a circle around the level and saving quit. Up. Yeah, that's what I did. Ooh, Dingo's done. And GGS. He didn't even collect the ten inside. Sack bag. <laughs> Look at this guy. Wait, where are you guys? I feel like I got every possible note. I'm like wondering where you. You can get every single note. Really? Yeah. Wait. So how do you get? Uh, wait, let me think. Oh, I knew the 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 Hailfire Peaks trouble is possible, but I wasn't gonna try that because I heard it's really hard. Greetings. It might be a lot easier with Super Bowl, though. Pg Dingo. Uh oh. Good job, Dingo. How do you get the notes um, up on the hill in GGM? 
Uh, there's this you thing called pack quite quite cool. fine. Yeah. So if you jump into a slope, uh, and you land on the slope while like in the pack whack animation and jump out of it, you get your pack whack jump back. So you just constantly jump into the slope pack whack, jump into the slope pack whack, and you climb up. I think I was just sad. No one got. I was like trying a bunch 51. of different stuff with pack whack there. Nothing was working. Yeah. Looks like Bex is doing ban for the trouble. Oh. And just taking the penalty. That's fine. Or maybe maybe she thinks you can like open the door as the van, and then she's gonna try to come back with solo banjo, and then be very sad. Oh no. Uh. <laughs> Ooh, Dingo's really quiet. Yeah. Probably with. And I can barely oh, wait, is this better? Yes, yeah, this is way better. <laughs> Welcome back. The wrong, the wrong mic was, like, selected for Discord. Okay. Oh my god, look at this van, it's zooming! What? I didn't notice Super Vanjo <laughs> oh, yeah. also Super works Vanjo. on transformation. Super Vanjo. Yeah, it works for Mumbo as well. Uh, she's just getting it. <laughs> That's fine, though. Oh wait, how do you get the the notes in JRL in the fucking I don't know what well, you the you enemies? Swim down from yeah. on top. Oh. But I think it's only good for the treble because yeah. it's has a hit, bigger hitbox. You need I didn't double air. Yeah, swimming. You need double air to get Actually, the two smaller ones. Yeah. I never got the two smaller ones because it was just too far out of the way, but I got deflected pretty early when I tried to dip down for the uh for the treble clef. Yeah, I just didn't that. think it was possible, so I skipped those. I was just mm -hmm. expecting to skip 30 in JRL, and also 30 in Witchy World. I don't think there's any way to get those 30, the last 30, right? The there are. World. Yeah, last, yeah. Oh. yeah, well, did you see what Cole posted, Xernicus? Yeah, but how do you even get up there? What is that? You take the gondola. Take the gondola across, and then just. You can definitely get the around. area fifty-one notes, though. I did get those. Yeah. Oh, He's did you like get those by jumping off the light? Yeah. yeah, I did. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. That was a good thought. I didn't even think of that. He's not like starting <laughs> on the gondola. He starts <laughs> like out of bounds behind the wall. Oh, well, uh, you want to see the entire video for that? I'll make one right now. I I just didn't know about that. Oh, uh, Bex is warping That's to the cool, start. Though. You got Super no. Banjo, just pack whack across. You don't even need Super Banjo, just pack whack uh, across, yeah, he just bro. Makes it. Maybe, Maybe she, she thinks she needs, she needs the note at the top. Maybe. Wait. She's got like 780 right now. She probably already has that note at the top. She might. Otherwise, yeah. she would have had yeah, enough without does. the trouble. She has all the notes mm -hmm. except the uh, 30 at the top. Yeah. <laughs> Wrong move, Bex. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> and he waddles so fast. Yeah. Time. GG. GG. All right, let's pull GG. her in. All right, GGs. GG. 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 All right, there's a full video if you want to see Zenrikus. Oh, thanks. All right, good job, Bex.